here we have got the glossy box advent calendar to unbox here it is here for us how exciting is this this is quite a pricey advent calendar i think it retails for around 99 pound but there is loads of offers and things like that on this advent calendar so i will have it linked down below and if there's an offer i'll have that down in the description box that um with it too i didn't pay that i saved my glossy credits um so i did get it a little bit cheaper but there is always deals going. So you're getting it around the £80 mark normally, I would say. But it is £99 for 24 days. And we're going to unbox it and see what this advent calendar. So this works it? out at the £99 mark at £3.96 per day. So I'm hoping that we'll see some value in this. Um, I will say the quality, quality of the advent calendar feels... Um, not as good as it normally is like the other ones you could use as like beauty storage but these I just don't think the quality is there the way it normally is but we're going to unbox it in anyways and anyways I feel like it's giving me very much next advent calendar vibes in the design Um, where is 25 oh there right so we're going to get in it in anyways day number one let's see Day number one and anyways we've got the precision jewel contour pot all oh, right okay this is in the shade medium shadow i haven't watched any unboxings of these because i always like to try and be su 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 surprised so this is one shade and does it open again yeah it looks like it opens twice i think I don't get this oh yeah and then it's got like a cream one underneath um i do like iconic london products but yeah i'm not so sure if i like that product but i'll give it a go to be honest one is a cream one is a powder i think so it's day number one we're on day number two which is this one yeah we have got something from spectrum it looks like a mini brush i mean you just know i love a mini brush um, this is a mini BO5 brush. Oh my god, look at the brush! It is so pretty. It is a full size top part brush, I feel like, but with just the mini handle. I'm not mad at that. I quite like it. I think it's really pretty, to be honest. But I know a lot of people would probably be mad at that. That is D number two. D number three, which is up here, we've got something from color wow it is a pop and lock high gloss finish i think it's glitter for your hair is this glitter for your hair or is this a serum for your hair with glitter in great so this is it yeah yeah i think it's gel for your hair apply evenly to wet hairstyle as usual but with like glitter in that is it there. I don't want to look in the book because then I get spoilers. It's a hair serum. <laughs> I looked in the book. I've been very careful not to get spoilers. So that's day number three. When day number four, we have got something I've never seen before. It is from Forest Essentials. It's a luminating body oil. And this is the packaging here. Um, wow, that smell it was not what i was expecting from the color that smells lovely uh yeah so that is that product you would think i was be a big fan of body oils you know because i've got dry skin but my sensitive skin seems to not like them <laughs> so that's day number four we went day number five we have got let's have a look we have got the beauty crop milk mini mist this is seal and set and mist Oh, so it's a setting mist. Let's have a go with this. Um, the beauty crop is really starting to come out of its shell and becoming popular. That smells lovely. Um, yeah, so I'm very excited about that because I've raved about the beauty crop for years. I used to love the little highlighter and like a little nail varnish pot. I used to rave about that all the time. So I'm excited that they're coming more popular. And that is a nice mist. It's definitely a moisture mist. Moisture just missed and that was five one six we have got something from laneige oh i love laneige 
or Laneige, Laneige, I think it's Laneige. This is the Water Bank Blue Hyaluronic Cream Moisturiser. Let's have a look at you then. It comes with its own little spatula. I like that we're getting a different brand. This is the packaging. I mean, bougie as anything, it's sealed. So I'm actually going to leave it sealed and look this up. Very excited about this. Bougie, bougie. Love a bit of Laneige. Um, or Laneige, Laneige. That was day number six. We went to day number seven, which is up here. We have got something from Refai. I've heard Jessica Braun talk about this brand before. This is a brown brow pencil and it is in the shade medium. This is what the packaging looks like. It's very long. Um, oh my God, look how ultra fine that tip is. That is so fine. Oh my God, that is exciting. I love a brow pencil. Yeah, so I'm quite excited about this. I've heard good things about this brand as well. So yeah, that's exciting. So that was day number seven. We want day number eight. We have got something from Nip and Fab. This is the vitamin C fixed tonic. So it's like um, a vitamin C toner, I would say. Good size as well. I love their vitamin C scrub for your face as well. So I'm excited about trying their tonic. That was day number eight. We went to day number nine, which is this one here. We have got the Land of Lashes, four minx lashes, reusable lashes. I've received these in a box before, which makes me a little bit like, oh, I've already received these before. They are really nice lashes. I mean, look at the curl on them. But yeah, I you know when you get a repeat product? I can't remember if it's Glossy Box or the Fantastic. I did get it in though. But if this is if I got that in a Glossy Box... I think I did and all that's a kind of annoying do you know what I mean so that was nine yeah I mean day number 10 we have got something I've received before that is the bye bye eye plump eye cream did we just get this in a beauty box I feel like we did it was a glossy box if it was that's kind of annoying you know if we're getting repeat products because if you're subscribed to the Glossy Box, that's annoying, do you know what I mean? Um, yeah, that was day number 10, but loads of people say that eye plump is really nice. Um, so that's day number 10, we're on day number 11, which is this one here. Oh, we've got two products. Love it too. Do, 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 do. We have got the Locketane Shampoo and we've got the Locketane Conditioner. I might gift this to my mum, she likes Locketane. Um, or I may keep them for myself, I haven't decided yet. We'll see how much shampoo and conditioner I've got. But yeah, that is fab day though. Love Locktain. Locktain. Mmm, smell lovely and all. Really, really nice. Glad they put both in. They're not the biggest, they're 35ml, but I quite like that they've got both in. At least that's 11. We want day number 12, which is this one. Yeah. We've got something from X Lash Pro and it is a pro eyelash serum. I'm going to actually look this up and see if this could be used as a brow serum as well. And um, actually, we're there. What day are we on? 12. I'll go to 12 in this and see if it says anything. Um, Longer looking lashes are just 28 days away. X Lash Pro Lash Serum uses a clinically proven combo of biotin, peptide green tea and hyaluronic acid. It's 100% vegan, dermatologically tested, oil and hormone free and formulated with sensitive skin. So this is £65. Wow. Um, yeah, I think I might see if this works for your brows. That's day number 12. I want day number 13. We've got the In Transit Camera Close-Up Primer from This Works. This I've seen so many times. It's not exciting to me. I like this product. It's not about a bad product. It's just, you know, when you've had it in beauty boxes and things like that a lot, it just doesn't excite you anymore after so long. But it's a good product. But I've had it recently. So that's day number 13. We're on day number 14, which is up here. We have got something from Milk Makeup. I... I think I've tried one milk makeup product. This is the Milk Makeup Rise Mascara. I'll put a picture of it on the screen here. But I'm not gonna open it just in case. I'm gonna keep it. So that was 14. We want day number 15, which is this one here. We have got something from Carez. 
the night brighten and sleep of facial i feel like we've gotten this in a box recently too am i having deja vu moments i'm gonna have to look at my instagram pictures because i feel like i'm having deja vu moments um yeah i love Carrera's as a brand really nice brand really nice product but i just feel like we've had this off look fantastic not look fantastic off glossy box that was 15 we want day number 16 oh we have got something from one month skin so that's exciting it is the rose gold brightening facial mask this is probably about 100 quid um what day is it this is so i was way off this is 20 pound i was way off that is exciting it is a bougie brand one one skin i don't know why i was getting 100 quid from but yeah that is day number 16 we went a day number 17 which is down here we have got something from p louise wow <laughs> don't think i'm gonna be using this product Um, i really like p louise um this is a lip base i'm gonna have a word with the girls and see if they know like if, this, if you can use these as blushes and things like that but this is in the shade so you can slay all the day and it is a a lip base but i mean that's intense i like a red lip but this is orange you know that's intense <laughs> so that was day number 17 we went day number 18. Yeah, the colour of that one just didn't make sense to me. Um, we've got something we've had. We've getting this in definitely in a box or something. This is the Earth Harbour Lunar Rain. Oh, it's different. It is a Phyto Resurfacing Night Serum. The one we got last time was different. Yes, that's exciting. It says N... N Endow your skin with raindrops of moonlight magic. A rich, lightweight serum featuring a medley of seaweed collagen. Yes, please. Give me that. I need the collagen. That was 18. We want 19. We have got... Is it just a one day? It is. We have got the set of fill, which is a small size, I will say. When we done the River Island at Benkanda, we got two in one day of these. And um, this is the Gentle Skin Cleanse cleanser and it was 29 mil and it is for normal dry skin and the river island i've encountered is cheaper so that's 19 we want day number 20 which is here and we have got another paradox this brand is doing its rounds it's turning into philip clinsley <laughs> It is the Moisture Express hair mask. I really, really like their hair mask, but they are in like, I think they've been in nearly every other account I've unboxed. Um, yeah, so, but it is a good product. It really is. So if this was your only advent calendar, then I, you know, you would be dead excited, you know? So that was day number 20. Did I definitely want 19, yeah? 20, we want day number 21. Down here, it's a big square. Let's hope it's exciting we have got something that feels very heavy and chunky um what are you it is a coconut coffee scrub oh my god this is like the scrub but the, the frank body scrub has got a big bag <laughs> it's so messy this scrub but it is a nice scrub wow um yeah i'm excited about that because i have never had the big bag and I have been false tanning recently, so I feel like that would help, but it is so messy, so messy. So that was day number 21. We went day number 22. This one here. We have got the Gosh Brand Brow Lift Lamination Gel. Ooh. Ooh, so this is basically to give you eyebrows the laminated effect that's exciting i have had my brows laminated before i've got very thin brows and um, like nothing bare brows i basically draw them all on and um, so that's i'm excited but i don't know whether that's something i'll use a lot but we'll see 22 we want 23 this little one here we have got more than one product in a door that's exciting we have got two Glossier products, so these are pricey products, and I'm quite excited about these. We have got the Cloud Pain, I'm very excited about this, really excited actually. It is their Seamless Cheek Colour in the shade Beam. I love the packaging, I'm sorry, like, I love that day. 
I love that day, yeah. And then we've got the birthdaybomb.com universal skin salve. Swipe onto lips for a loving layer of moisturiser. And this is what this looks like. So I think it's just like a lip balm. Yeah, it's just like a lip balm. But how exciting is that? So exciting. Really excited about the cloud paint. Yeah, that is me making it up for it. That's day number 23. We want day number 24. Oh, we've got two more products in this day as well. How exciting. Oh, yes. And we've got Rituals. We've got the Rituals of Jing Relax soothing body cream i'm not the biggest fan of the rituals of jing scent but i do know somebody who is yeah it's just not for me um it's all right but rituals is square all the way but then we've got the rituals of a radar are you radar home harmonizing foaming shower gel and i've just get in their reed diffuser i haven't had this one but that sounds beautiful so yeah i'm quite excited about that and i know who i'm gonna Give this one along too. So yeah, that's twenty four. Far far making up for the rest of the calendar. Last but not least is day number twenty five, and we have got something from Magnetone London. Ooh, it is a microsonic soft touch silicone facial cleansing brush. It is a three in one cleanse and massage like facial device, which we kind of got the same sort of thing in the Look Fantastic Advent calendar. Um, this one you charge yourself though and it's like the one that you hold like that. I'm very excited about it. Oh, it's actually got battery. Oh yeah, I'm quite excited about that. Very much so. Yeah, that will be something that I will use. I got a Ferrero mini one in the Amazon Advent Canada last year and I really liked it. I really liked it so yeah I'm, I'm happy with that day very happy so that is the glossy box advent calendar unboxed this advent calendar was a nice advent calendar but and they really did pull it back out the bag towards the end of the advent calendar but i will say if you get glossy box subscription i feel like you're getting a lot of repeat products in my opinion um and I just think to beginning the calendar wasn't very exciting in, for me personally because I do get a lot. I do get glossy box every month and I feel like there was a lot of repeats. I don't know if that was because it was glossy box and look fantastic, but I did feel like I got a lot of repeats. But overall, the value is there. But yeah, it's not like the way it used to be where it was like, yes, yes, yes. Um, I really, honestly, on this price point, in my opinion, I'm going to sit and see it now because I've unboxed quite a lot of Avon calendars. I feel like the ASOS one is the best value in my opinion obviously marks and spencers is coming um soon uh but the asos one is the best value and then i would go with Ireland if i if you were personally asking me but i will link this down below for you and anyways i hope you enjoyed this unboxing um yeah i've still got lots of avant candles to come so if you haven't already i would love it if you subscribed i think i've unboxed around 30 maybe more this year um but yeah, there's some more to come. So I would love if you subscribe if you haven't already. And I will see you all in my next video. Bye.